Hello kind person, I appreciate you watching so much. So today I'm so excited to share five easy eco-friendly swaps that I have made in order to be zero waste, you know? eco-friendly swaps that I had made in my zero waste journey. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, do not forget to like, comment, and share with a friend so that we can be better at taking care and stewarding over what the Lord has created. Number one is I switched to a wooden toothbrush or a bamboo toothbrush because it's made of natural elements, meaning that it will be easy to decompose on the earth and compared to a plastic toothbrush, which is still here, the first toothbrush that was probably made in the 1800s is still here today um, which is bad for the earth the environment I use it every day it's super easy although I will say when I first switched to it it was sort of uncomfortable to the mouth but after that I got used to it and it was fine so the second eco swap that I have made is period underwear <laughs> So I switched to this pretty early on and I have the review on it so you can check it out. It's pretty cool. I like the review and the little experiment that I did but I am so in love with using period underwears. It's not only convenient for me but it's also very 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 eco-friendly because literally one pad can last 500 to 800 years on the earth without completely decomposing and that's more than several lifetimes of one being like that's you know like by the grace of god i would love to be a hundred like and still be alive but bro like 500 to 800 years my guy oh my goodness you know so i made this switch pretty early on because the impact of using pads is just way too hi and if you're a guy and you're watching this and you can't switch to period underwear just take care of your drawers you know <laughs> okay so the third eco-friendly swap that i have made is using a water bottle a reusable water bottle you know like if you've been around if you've been around me i'm always talking about water or if i'm not talking about water like i'm always drinking water and i realized that i would go through several bottles of water like in a day like eight you know like depending on the day you know i would have like eight plastic bottles that i'm throwing away i was like whoa you know so it's better to just have a reusable water bottle not only am i taking care of my health but i'm making less impact on the earth so stay hydrated but do it in a way that's eco-friendly you know so my fourth eco-friendly swap having packed lunch okay so i used to want to buy lunch but i quickly realized that it's so wasteful <laughs> and so since high school I have been packing my lunch and even now in college and at work like I pack my lunch and I bring it because I'm using my own utensils um, and then the food is healthier and with the bowl that I'm using it is a glass bowl it's so pretty it makes me want to eat but at the same time like it's eco-friendly because it's long-lasting having packed lunch is a switch that I've been more adamant in doing so that I make less waste and lastly of course we can't forget to use reusable bags you know we can't forget the reusable bags the impact of plastic and plastic bags is so crazy like you wouldn't even believe it but I have a whole fun creative video about plastic bags and their impacts and so you could check that out even after this video I really like it <laughs> I really like that video and so you will like it as well so yeah these are the five eco-friendly swaps that I have made I have so much more swaps that I have made so I'm going to be letting you guys know and keeping you guys up to date with that but I would love to know which one of these swaps do you think is the easiest to make you'd be surprised and which one you I found the easiest so yeah let's chat let's have a conversation in the comments below and yeah remember to be kind to yourself and those around you including the earth until next time <laughs>